Most formulas for success are disarmingly simple. Buy low, sell high, build a better mousetrap, a jug of wine, a loaf of bread, and all those little sayings your grandmother passed on. The poet Kipling gave us one brief look at a complex subject when he said, a woman was only a rag, a bone, and a hank of hair. Until today, that might have been a successful inventory, but Iara Scudera has added another dimension with a string. She's imported something called the string bikini from her native Rio de Janeiro to a new east side boutique called Buzos, named for the most glamorous beach in Brazil. People are getting more broad minded about it and all that. I'm sure that the woman, like you said, they will win something like that, but that's how fashion goes anyway. Of course, the idea wasn't new elsewhere in France or in South America. Now in France, it's quite new. In, in Brazil, that's not new. In Brazil, they leave for bikinis instead of or for big wardrobe and clothes. They always think on bikini. Everybody has 20 bikinis minimum at home, you know. They care more for the bikinis because that's what they do. They walk in the beach a lot. Women here, more, uh, even if they are very beautiful, very much in place, and they're always complaining that this is that and that. The Brazilian girls, you see, sometimes they are not what you can say a fantastic body, but I never see them complaining about it. They always feel that the bodies are beautiful. Now, there are a lot of nice things about this story, right down to the miniature shopping bags, which could hold six string bikinis and a picnic lunch as well. Window shopping has never been better. On New York's East 70th Street, I'm Andy McMillan.